Don't do it. I can't watch every show that's ever existed. Because I'm some real shit. If you think about it, we've been riding through this world all along. Are you quoting it? I'm. I mean, it, it is what it is. <laughs> Riding through uh, this world all alone. <laughs> R.P. Jesus Opie. Christ. Spoiler alert. I mean, it's been out for a while now. If you haven't seen it, oh well. Well, now I'll never watch it, and it's your fault. No, nah. <laughs> right. You're gonna fall in love with him, and then he just gets beat in the head with a lead pipe. It seems like a show that I, my fragile uh, psyche, wouldn't be able to handle. It's not that bad. <laughs> you watch Rick and Morty. It's a cartoon, and I can always go back to it. it's a cartoon, and it's not real. Uh, no matter how many times you watch a movie now, especially, you can go, uh, Alec Baldwin killed that bitch. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hey, I'm just saying. <laughs> you slip a little bit and that wrench is going to hit somebody. Or... Is T.Y. here? <laughs> <laughs> is it this chair? Shout out, Flyboy. <laughs> shout out, yeah. Shout out, Flyboy Young. Half the time, I don't even watch a movie because it's spoiled before I even watch that shit. Yo, straight You guys, up. if you go online, it it's over. I definitely still haven't seen... Uh, the Don't say it. Man. Oh. I have avoided every spoiler, so that's impossible. You have, have some sort of self-induced amnesia <laughs> that you're. How can you go on he social media it. and not know what Zero. happened? He does it. He does if it. I see if I see anything related to spider, quick scroll, done. Move past it. That's crazy. Nothing. Your eyes, eyes must be control. super slow. Yeah. No, they're not. They're super fast. <laughs> that's super fast eyes. So I can look past it. Three, two, one. Welcome, everybody. Back to Super Smash Productions. You have Crash. You got Doovy. You got Sean. And? Illegal Seagull. What's your real name? Austin. All right, welcome, Austin. <laughs> Shout out my man. A Boogie uh, with no hoodie in the building. You know what I'm saying? He does have a hoodie on, though. Usually, he doesn't. Well, today... It's just something be. I'm used to saying. He, he gets it. Yeah, okay. but the first time, you can't say it when he's wearing uh, a hoodie. It yeah, doesn't work. Yeah, it works for me. <laughs> we are missing T.Y. Um, I feel like we'll still bring the... Uh, the fire and the gasoline tonight, though. Oh, so, uh, oh yeah. Shout out Flyboy yeah. Young. It's a different kind of energy, but there will be energy nonetheless. Oh, yes. So, with you sitting there and manifesting all of it? I hope so. I feel like it's that seat. Oh, man. <laughs> There's something going on. I don't know if uh, it's the seat or the guy sitting in it. Yo, so how about, right, Samantha tried to log on to the internet on the Wi-Fi on her computer the other day. And, like, the main internet is called Crash, and it wouldn't pop up. Now I have a Wi-Fi extender upstairs, and it's two separate lines. So it's called your mom's holes and your dad's holes. All right? So this is her work computer. She couldn't get connected to the internet. (laughs) And her boss's husband is the IT guy for the computers. So, she had to call this dude uh, to get the internet back onto her computer. <laughs> she goes, don't mind my husband. He thinks he's hilarious, but... Um, she had to preface the, it. The, the holes? Yeah, that's that's my internet. <laughs> I was like... <laughs> <laughs> Fucking dying in the background. <laughs> and then he needed the password to get on the actual like network. And it is also very vulgar. <laughs> <laughs> and then she had to read that out to it, <laughs> and she just kept Fantastic. looking over at me. I was like, "This is what it's here for. This is the exact reason why I have these as my yeah. as my Wi-Fi's and as my password. Because if somebody asks you about it, they're gonna be like, uh, why? That's that's why. I would be it's extremely thankful. Starter. It's you turned a completely mundane activity into something hysterical. 
Have you ever seen some of these fucking Wi-Fi names? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Fucking ridiculous. I Anybody was... who's ever tried to steal somebody else's Wi-Fi <laughs> knows what they somebody are. Somebody changed theirs to, like, FBI security van. I wanted to it's change like, mine to pedophile van, and she would not allow me with her being, with her being a mental health specialist <laughs> for children. <laughs> it sends a, it, a negative message. <laughs> I mean, it can. The drone one is popular, too. You'll see a lot of people setting shit as drones, so it makes people think that you're watching them and everything, along the FBI thing that you were talking about. That's what I'm saying. But it's like, the, just a random... Ad. I can't fucking pull any out of the air right I now, did, but like, I they have, have something one. to do with like Wi-Fi or internet or... Well, that was a fail. Um, <laughs> moving on. By my, by my house, a dude had one that said, I'm definitely not pirating. <laughs> and it was all caps. That was my old apartment years ago. I wonder what people think when it just pops up your mom's holes or your dad's holes. Probably the same face everybody else makes. Like, uh, just, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, There's a Karen response out there. Oh, yeah, you're there's just, a normal response. You're just minding your business. All yeah. of a sudden, your dad's holes. <laughs> holes, <laughs> holes with an S, though. And oh. then, like, what other holes Exactly. Are you just go, ah. Uh. <sighs> yeah, that's life. Yeah. That's that was that was my exciting story for the week. Oh my god! <laughs> I was like, I cannot. As soon as she ended that call, I was like, I cannot wait to tell that on the podcast. She's like, Don't. I was like, Oh no, it's going down. I'm definitely <laughs> telling it. <laughs> Poor Sam, save the house. The house. I feel like I am. I am saving the house right now because <laughs> I'm fucking fixing the entire goddamn thing. It's all you can do when it's this fucking cold outside, man. It's frozen outside. No, it is not. It is a pregnant nesting wife is what's causing me having to rip um, all of the wallpaper off of the walls and then having to spackle every fucking hole that she decided to hang her 50 million pictures on. <laughs> and then she's just going to make holes again after we fucking paint them. Not a fan of those Velcro strips, huh? Ah, uh, no. <laughs> no, she's not. <laughs> Whenever I see the hammer come out, I'm like, well, there's another eight holes going uh, going into the wall. Oh, yeah, that's exactly how it happens in this house. So, my yeah. man tonight, our guest here, uh, Illegal Sequel, my man Austin. So, you, uh, you're you rapping. You know yeah. saying? You got music dropping and everything like that. You got to talk closer to the microphone. Right? No yeah. doubt, yeah. So, you got to move in. Yeah, you might have to move in a little bit, bro. Gotcha. Yeah, so, tell us a little bit about that, man. Like, what, do you, what is your next project? What are you working on? Uh, so I'm working on my, uh, second installment of Ill. Uh, I dropped, uh, my first EP, well, my first, like, serious EP, Ill, uh, last July, and, uh, I've just been working on some stuff for the past year now, and I'm just ready to get it out to the people, you know, so. Or, so what kind of, you doing the beats, like, what's going on? Like yeah, bro, so, um, I do everything from producing it to mixing it mastering it um i do all my artwork and stuff so you ever get real fucked up and then just make some weird ass beat like i can spit some of this maybe (laughs) so is there is there a folder on your computer that just says "Eh, (laughs) maybe (laughs) bro it's it's more just the names of the beats you'll know i'll just name it some stupid shit that is T.Y. with every beat he has on his phone. He's like, oh, whatever I was feeling that day. It has nothing to do with his song at all. <laughs> and he just names the beats random fucking things. He has a whole folder that's just listed the emoji guy going like this. Like, I don't know. Whatever's going on. <laughs> Maybe. You know? Yeah, no, no doubt. Like, uh, But yeah, that's what I'm saying. I have like so many beats, I lose track of them. So, I, um, How pro- many do you think you have? Probably... Probably around 200, maybe more. Damn. How, how many will you never use? Probably more than half of those. <laughs> <laughs> like, as for, as for their fire, but, like, it's just when you're feeling, uh, you know, when you're just in the moment and you're really feeling that beat. Because sometimes I'll go back to older stuff and just... Oh, yeah. It'll open something up for me, so... But, yeah... It's a loud ass truck out there. Yeah, who, yeah. <laughs> Damn. I think that's they're trying every, to make it up the that's alley. Every truck, yo. <laughs> With fucking <There's fuck> <laughs> an, an ice filled alley. They're trying to make it up. Like <laughs> <an> <laughs> <asshole. laughs> trying to make it up the alley. They had a fucking full send <laughs> to get up the alley. Throw, throw the chains on. Oh, yo. <laughs> yo if, you see, if you see somebody doing that nowadays, bro, 
Yo, you gotta pull them over and you fuck know, them up. You know they used to live in Alaska. If they got chains on. Oh, the they, they used to, used to be able to do that shit back in the day out here. I don't see why you can't. You, you can't. say back in the day, you make me feel so old. I had chains on my tires when I first started driving. Are you the, not allowed in, to do it anymore? In the Poconos. No. I lived in the Poconos. I lived in the city. It's, it's just the law. You can't do it. Yeah. Do it you really, see anybody doing it? Colin. I mean, Can it, you see if that's a law or not? It's, 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 I need, it, I need obviously to know like Mad Max. <laughs> when you see, look at the streets of Wilkes-Barre. You say you can't right. ride with chains on them. Yeah, you're like yeah, Mad Max. I can now. Oh, definitely you're not supposed to. No. Do you see anybody doing it? It's you, only if you, you get caught. <laughs> that is not how the law works. Do you see anybody doing it? <laughs> Nobody's running the stoplight, so it must be a law. Oh, hold on, we got a fact. You, you can if there's... Temporarily if there's an emergency. Right, you can't drive around like Mad Max in the summer. Like, click, 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 click. In an emergency, Coming who has time to throw chains on their tires? <laughs> I mean, most cars are like all-wheel drive now, but... Damn, yeah, Tom Hardy's wilding. <laughs> I, I do see the postal uh, delivery trucks driving with them on sometimes, though. But I it's mean, they, be they really have to yeah. at that point. But that's a federal employee; they can do whatever they want. You hanging out with Doc from Back to the Future? Because I ain't see this shit. Doc, well, you don't. Your mail doesn't get delivered. <laughs> oh, <laughs> my mail! My mail gets delivered every day. They don't deliver mail at your ah, house. Yo, I fixed that. Yo, so check this out. So I ain't had mail. <laughs> I know you didn't <laughs> to my house in like, like, like at least three weeks, like three and a half weeks, right? No he's mail, like, yo, man. my he's like, this my calendar year, no mail. mail. No mail this calendar year, like, right. and I'm you were there, blaming your neighbor. Yeah, and I'm sitting there thinking, like, cool, like, you know, my like my bills is paid, so cool. Like, I ain't got to worry about nothing. You know what I'm saying? And then like, you get that email, like, hey, past due. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> hurry up, pay up. Yeah, you need to pay up. So I'm like, yo, I ain't get the physical bill. So like, I thank God for technology. But I like, like, I had this conversation with Sean. I like, the I, like phys- I, I definitely like, yeah, I like the physical, and I like. It. I feel like we're in, we're the in between. Yeah. Like, Generation, yeah, for every, yeah, because our parents kept every fucking bill next to the phone. Right, they didn't have the internet. Yeah, yeah. you almost have a complex where you have to have that physical copy. I can see it online, but I gotta have that. Exactly. Physical copy Those will form. sit unopened on my counter for three fucking months, <laughs> but I know I have. The but I know I got it exactly. Somewhere. Do you have one of those exactly old people baskets or letter separator things where it goes with it and everything? I have one of the I mean, old I have person a baskets. Filing cabinet for like after I pay them, I literally oh, open them after I pay them and write paid, and then put them in the where? filing. That's cabinet. That's the way to do it. I write. Two months on my later, <laughs> two months later, I do it though. I do like like a mass one. It's like, oh, this one's from August. Okay, I definitely paid that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna put it in the filing cabinet. Just, just boosting your morale. <laughs> yeah, I paid that shit. Yeah, yeah. That. Put that shit. <laughs> put that shit in the shelf. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly how it works. Yeah. Honestly, you just need to get a stamp. I actually had one, but I lost it in the separation. Uh. That's what I call my last relationship because I lost a lot of shit. At least I didn't lose my house. Is it my socks? <laughs> Damn. Bro, shit was missing for like mm. three weeks after I was still finding shit that was missing from this house. Mm. The most upset is I lost my cats. Uh, took both of them. Mm. Fucking cat at me. I was hoping you weren't going to say a pet. I was hoping like some hoodie from high school. No, you go, You pull a fucking pet oh. out of your pocket here. Yeah. His name is Kylo. Damn. Like Ren? Yeah. Like the... yeah. Yeah. I like when people name their ass. cats like that because it dates your animal. I can figure out everything just by you saying that. Like, okay, Kylo Ren, I know when the cat I know the whole timeline of the story now just from At the name least of the seven cat. Years ago. <laughs> Eight years ago. Well, just because of the movie and <laughs> right. everything. I always crack up at the live reactions when uh Ray was supposed to be the, like the new Skywalker. People got up. They were just like, yo, fuck this shit. You just see people mad as shit throwing it a, popcorn. It was a disaster. Ooh. And it just goes to the whole thing where we keep talking about what we need to do. Oh, we need, to, we need to sit and write a movie, a script, an actual screenplay. I feel like we've had like a conversation like that. Before. Must Me have. and Doobie like, oh, we got to write something. And then nothing ever fucking happens. Nothing comes to fruition. We're still supposed to be making, um, you know, TikTok fucking little shorts for you guys but uh that has also not come to fruition yet. <laughs> but we do have some wigs well we had technical difficulties for a, li- for a little bit towards the end of the summer and now we're back we're gonna call so. it the time skip oh yeah so you know we'll definitely begin some shit what out. else you have going on tell us a crazy story uh i'll just put you right on the spot Boom. <laughs> what's the what's the weirdest thing that ever happened to you in your life oh man <laughs> yeah <laughs> one that takes the cake <laughs> Man, I don't even know. Because <laughs> you've been put on the spot. They're That's killing what I'm it. saying. Um, <laughs> wig, wig segue. Yeah. No. 
That's oh, honestly, I can't even I'll think off one, the top I'll, right now. I'll tell, I'll tell you one of mine. Swinging. I was gonna say I'll pull one if you yeah, need. So, and I lost my cat. So what's going on? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want to be sad anymore. I wanted to laugh. You really it's Kylo, bro. So anyways, bro. You really did leave it hanging on that sad, sad. I didn't, I didn't want to be sad anymore. So I tried to move on. And that's just how this works. Nobody told you to start hearing Sarah McLaughlin. <laughs> <laughs> So what's going on, bro? <laughs> I watched I watched a video the other day. It's like I had never seen a, a Chinese food commercial, and then that video came up playing. Oh, like, oh, oh no! We love animals. <laughs> Ooh, sometimes commercials are just perfectly placed. Oh, is it hot in here? Wasn't there a Domino's commercial That's right good, after a uh, wrestler was cutting somebody's face with a pizza cutter? Uh, Jericho was cutting a pizza gauge. cutter. Oh, bro, that's that's nothing. You need to. I'll send you some videos of some death I matches. I'm not. It's easy watch to watch them. It's, it's an easy, easy watch, bro. Oh no, he doesn't like blood and shit. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> that just, backyard wrestling. Yeah, that is yeah. crazy. Hardcore. Yo, stuff. I, yo, I was telling him at work. <laughs> I was telling him at work. I said, "Yo, let me run into some money, bro. I'm starting like a, a CZW somewhere." CZW. Bro, Jesus Christ. Bro, people Straight listen. Up. I'm just afraid he might try and get in the ring himself and then just... What's wrong with that? <laughs> Dude would be like, so weak, so bold. I told myself, <laughs> if we just put up some two-by-fours back here, <laughs> we could just segue into the garage after we're done. You know, trying to build a wrestling ring? I ain't getting my no. ass in the ring, bro. <laughs> so what? Please don't. What if I did? I could be the Vince McMahon of my own shit. No. <laughs> <laughs> you could be the black Owen Hart. Not for a good reason. Oh, End up dead in the ring. Who, who's Jesus putting, Christ. Who, minute, who's putting my big ass on the damn fucking zip line? <laughs> number one. No. Number one. Touche. You know what I'm saying? That's, there's no number two because I don't have anything to say to number, number one. Two, I'm not getting up two, there. you're going to be dead. So right. whatever. And I'm not getting up there. Hey, hey, dude, I know this is your company and all, <laughs> but we're going to need you to zip line <laughs> to the middle of the ring. We're going to need you to Peter Pan that right. shit all the way to the middle of the ring. <laughs> Ain't no waivers to sign. I'm gonna be like, what's the rocket? What's the rocket pack budget looking like? <laughs> <laughs> Somebody call Elon. Do you see that new? Do you see the jetpack that that dude made? Nah. Oh, it's badass, dude. I want one. People could think this shit is Destiny too. All they want, bro. I'm gonna be on a hoverboard before I die. Swear to God, one that's up off the ground. Bro, <laughs> we're already seven the- years old. I'm in. The I was air, gonna say bro. we already in our thirties. What you doing? 70, he doesn't want that pink Mattel air. hoverboard shit. He I'm wants. in the air, bro. I'm seven years old. I'm going. Full Yo, you play hockey, right? Yeah. Yo, what's that like? Speaking of snow and shit, what's that dude, like? It's fun. It's like gliding. Just, I can dude. It's so skate. weird, bro. I don't know, cause I used to like roller skate when I was younger. <laughs> so like straight up. <laughs> Like, I just used to go to Skate Away all the time when I was younger. Facts. So Shout out glory, Skate uh, The glory days are over. No, no, no doubt. 75 cent nachos. <laughs> but, yeah, no, it's just weird, bro, because, like, locals you don't really stop on the ice, bro. And if you don't, if you just, like, stand straight up, you just fall straight on your back. It's like dudes be out there getting fucked up for real? Uh, yes. I mean, like, it's a lot Quick of control control to play hockey. Yeah, dude, I mean, some of the people in our league are good, but, I mean... We're all, you know what I'm saying? We yeah. just go out there and have fun and shit. How so bad do your pads stink? <laughs> Luckily, I bought them new, so it's just my stink, but it's good for now. <laughs> so, like, don't nobody be getting into fights and shit? Because, see, if I was oh, playing. Oh, dude, there's, like. Oh, there's fights? Not, not, not fights. Like, we, we can't fight, but oh, there's all That's not hockey. Bro, bro there's altercations <laughs> and shit. <laughs> bro. I'm not trying to Is that to how black people out. say hockey? Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. The five of them. Uh, I don't know. I got excited. I'm like, oh, because I just picture Austin coming in. The- I'm not out there fighting. Because, like, we work together. So, like, I There's the him. same amount of black players in the NHL that there are uh, black coaches in the NFL. Mm. <clears throat> You're not wrong. Too real? No. Oh. No. No. I'm just thinking on it. And somehow in Keep my Keep going, head- Pastor. <laughs> 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 Keep going, Pastor. Well, it's... I mean, it's definitely, time. it's definitely a topic. We have, we talked about it. It could be for turf and turnbuckles and everything. But, I mean, NFL is hot right now. We That's can talk so, about it now. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, Let's get back to you not being able to fuck people up on the side. <laughs> you ever, like, want to fighting people over how bad your pads the game? Stink? Nah, not after. Yeah. Usually, like, in between, you know, you so no parking lot chirping people. Or no, so. no parking lot fisticuffs? Nah. Come on, man. Not me. Dude, some people take that shit passionate, though. You know what I mean? Like, some people get 
real angry. Like, to, some people are mad competitive. You know how that shit yeah. goes. So, we, all, uh, we all watch I mean, TikTok. Dude, like, we're all competitive <laughs> out there, but people just, I, I'm not a fighter, so. But some people do go out there and get like that, so. I remember when I played. I'm just trying to channel my Riley and Jonesy right now. <laughs> <laughs> I feel you. Mm-hmm. Nah, but I, uh, I, I remember I played in, like, a flag league for, like, two years straight, and, like. You know, we toot took it as toot. we took it as like fun and shit. But you got dudes out there like you see other games before your game. You a bitch, like yo, <laughs> bro, it's flag. <laughs> you will not see me on any sports field or court or, or rink <laughs> ever again in your life. Yo, I've been staying clear, bro. It's gonna. It's happen. always golf. I've been staying clear. Do I feel like I'd pull something? I feel like golfing. I end up going swinging. I end up pulling a groin or something. I just bro, I'm fuck out, myself bro, I'll be out swinging there. a goddamn club. I'll be out there. I don't pull yeah, shit. Yeah, go ahead. Get out there in the spring. See what happens. Ain't nothing gonna happen. When you realize... I can't even say that's like when you realize you're too old for this shit. Because like, once you get older, that's when people golf. Exactly. Right? So I'm doing safe old shit. I've been golfing <laughs> since I was 16. You don't have to be old to golf. I mean, it's well, not you're old a, now, right? Well, yeah. All but right. it's not a prerequisite. Like, what are you, like 52? Just, just south of it. <laughs> Forty six. So, you know. Nah. Why the buddy Sean. Christ thumbs? <laughs> <laughs> Trying to make you feel better. <laughs> it's not like I dress like those old ass people now, playing golf T-Y, and everything now like now that. If I told T Y he was fifty two, he'd get uh, so mad. At now me. I'm here, y'all. Going on sixty. Well, he's only fucking forty two. It's all right. Yeah. Shout out T Y. Just turned forty two. He looks the same age as you, <laughs> as you guys. You don't look that old. No, nah, no. Nah. I feel old some days. His but, hairline you know, says different. I can't wait for golf season, though. I'm gonna get the Are outfits. you sure? You because you're golfing? still a club nah, short from last nah, I don't year. Golf. <laughs> Have you ever tried golfing? Uh, Yeah, I tried it before. I used to work at a golf course. What was oh, that which like? one? Uh, Fox Hill. Oh, that's the rich good money. Doing. That's the one we... It wasn't bad. I did, like, banquet, but... Fox Hill. Wow. It was okay. a job, you Where know Where is that? Uh, in like Exeter, like by like West Pitson. We don't went by there. the comic book shop on that back road, right? You know, like where Forks Off, where that CVS is, right there. Yeah, like, we've we been, we been there. Yeah, no, we weren't. We didn't go there. We were gonna go. We there. didn't go we there. We weren't allowed no, there. Aww. <laughs> I was allowed in, but they have. <laughs> <laughs> this is your month. You <laughs> fight for that golf course spot. This is your month. <laughs> go play on that snow, bro. This is your month. You got it's this. It's your time. All my life, I <laughs> wanted here, to it's go. it's your time. It's your time down here. <laughs> oh, God. Dude. <laughs> nah, we never got turned away from this. <laughs> the last time I went golfing with Duval, this is, I tell this story every time I go now. I turn to him and I go, do you strap your golf cart on the back of the cart? He looks at me dead in the face goes, yeah, man. <laughs> I hit the gas, and the first thing that shoots off the back of the fucking cart is his golf bag and all the fucking clubs and everything. I just hit the brake, stare back at him. I'm like, "Do you want it to now? You want to? You want to try that again?" <laughs> Yo, we be out there on the golf course, wilding. Me, Sean, Sam. I feel like man. I would just want to play play jackass with him, like hide in the bushes and use an air horn. You kind of I, mean, I, I, I did that I shit in high school. I, I got in trouble and all that stuff. But I mean, if you get caught, you get in trouble. Yeah. Were you like the slow like runner of the group? I was doing donuts with a golf cart and then running away from the owner on his golf cart, and then <laughs> I jumped off my golf cart and let it careen into a stream. That's different than a fucking air <laughs> horn. I was going to say, I'll be driving different. around. I the went road full road. on like the other part of Jackass where they're like doing donuts with Yo, the mini golf shit they, on the top when of it they and everything. Full send off that statue over the ditch. <laughs> oh, oh, dude, one dude almost dies. He like goes unconscious for a minute. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Wasn't that done? They're coming out with a new right, movie. It's out. It came out, out today. Bro, I'm about uh, to go see that. Uh, uh. I heard what y'all said. I'm just <laughs> Son shouldn't have been driving. The golf cart. We're talking about the golf cart. We're talking about the golf cart. Uh, yeah, I definitely want to see the new one, though. Um, I can't wait to watch them just break shit the whole fucking time. Yo, I'm telling you, it's, I, from what I've... I've watched a couple of interviews with Johnny Knoxville, and he's like, yeah, we're old, and <laughs> yeah. our bones are not what they used to be. Yeah, he out here still getting... I seen that trailer. He was getting fucked. I'm telling you, that bull <laughs> fucked him up. <laughs> He's like, There's no scenario where he wins. No, he's like 53, too. So it's like, it's crazy. 
Like he's just Bro, getting it's... just like imagine like imagine like your pops <laughs> fifty three years old. It's just the nostalgia of that, you know what I mean? Because yeah. all of us grew up on that. So I grew up watching CKY. Word. Oh. Yeah, facts. Word. Right, what were you, 20 then when it came out? I think I was graduating high school, for real. Shots in college. Marjera's older brother. The only thing he ever did was write one good song. Oh, don't be sad for him. Who cares? Hey, listen, that song was on Tony Hawk. What? Which Tony Hawk was it? Man, I remember the, Yo, the that first was the OG, Tony Hawk. the pro skater. I was think. it on Tony Hawk? Yeah, that shit was on the Tony Hawk. Are you kidding me? <laughs> 96 Quiet Bitter Beings? It might have been no, on the CKY. Day. It might have been CKY on the is yeah. a band. Yeah. That's what I said, that, that song. I don't know the name of the song. I just know the tune. Was that on Tony Hawk called? What? That CKY. I don't think it was. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure it was. I know I heard that shit on the Tony Hawk yeah. game. That wasn't on like a Raw and SmackDown or something like that. Nah. Like that. <laughs> Vince England, that, that seemed shit like fuck. a trash year. So Bro, I'm going to call it Pro Skater 3. Oh, shit, Pro Skater dude, 3. He gonna... said Pro Skater 1. No, I just said pro, Tony Hawk. I didn't say no, no Pro. No, no. I didn't say no number. Max, bro. Is that American Wasteland or is it? They just remastered that. Underground is the GOAT. Tony Hawk Underground is the GOAT. They remastered one, two, and three. The first didn't one. They? Or the first yeah, one was I think the... it was like a big bundle of all the games. Yeah, you got together. one and two together for I like. I think it was like one and two. Yeah. Yeah. Like yeah, at the time, sick. I know that shit's on sale now, like seventeen dollars. Yo, Tony. Yo, if that's when you know you're old when you're talking about video game bundles and shit, and you're all like, <laughs> oh yeah, I got this. <laughs> the foe for foe. <laughs> <laughs> PS5 version two. She. <laughs> That's what they do now. That's how they, that's how they try and get you to get the PS5. If you buy a new game, you get the... I, at this point, I don't even need the goddamn PS5. Like, I barely play video games the way it is, so there's no reason... Bro, PC. What happens. PC oh, is man. the way to go. It's just, I want to get also one... also just way too much to build a good PC right now. Yeah, it's expensive. With all the fucking crypto mining, like... It's... All the hard drives are way too much right now. Yeah, it's like a... It's like a almost for a good a car and finding one that hasn't had the brakes beat off of it because it's been crypto mining for yeah. four years. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> I know them cards, them RTX, them whatever, them thirty nineties or whatever. Them shits is like what thirteen hundred a piece. Yeah, just Jesus. for just for like a like a card. Well, plus a the, card, yeah, yeah. Like, too much. Yeah, once they like, I don't know, just like before COVID or like in the middle of COVID, I built a PC. It wasn't nothing crazy, but. Uh, the prices went down, like the prices were down, and then right after I built it, they were, it would have been like double the price to build the same computer. Damn. And I only, like, it was less than a thousand dollars that I spent. Plus, I got like a graphics so card for my boy. Much. So yeah, but it's that, how well, that's they, a come up and a half. They yeah. justify, but yeah, the video, oh, sure, the consoles sure. are justified because of those prices. But it's only nice because, like, if you like that's Xbox or PS, you could get. <laughs> but I mean, if it's a thousand for like, that, but that's the PC. thing you you can you can emulate a lot of games too with the PC, right? So like yeah. some games that you can't get. I'm not saying that it's not the better option, but it's when you're a thousand dollars for something. Whether it's the middle or the low end, and then you're paying how much is a PS5 and an Xbox One? Uh, an Xbox One S is anywhere on after sale or resale. <laughs> I mean, are you talking about resale or like resale? Like if you 12. just found it on the shelf somewhere and you were like, like with oh, tax look. is probably like five something. Well, so it's, he, he's not even including the well, no, the, the, the uh, that's the, not a game. That's not the another Xbox controller. The Xbox One S is 350, but you're thinking you're going to spend another 150 dollars because you want to get a game. You got to get everything with it. You want to get the fucking. But you're still you know, looking at about a half or only two thirds of the price. Of the con- of the PC, so that's why PC gaming is not necessarily dying, but it's not necessarily between the I pricing. Like PC gaming of, is picking up together. a hell of a lot more because it's a one and done. You don't need the next gen. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. And but, you can you can sync controllers to it. But how I mean, often does everything you need a new your your laptop since we've been talking has become outdated? Like it's just it's an old ass joke, but it's the truth. Like as you're talking, not technology, with PCs though, because you even can, with the PC with the technology, you hit download and you get the latest upgrade. Yeah, it's that crazy now. All right, you you can upgrade. A well, I definitely card. I don't understand computers as well as anybody else, so I'll definitely take your word for it. Of course. Well, I know because you like you were like thirty when they came out. <laughs> it's 
kind of hard for old people to learn about new things. You know? I feel like you think I'm Al Gore. Is it this chair that you're making old jokes? <laughs> like, what the? I gotta take, I gotta take chair. shots at someone about age. I miss T.Y. I miss T.Y. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take the old can, joke. Can you he, old age, okay. can you old age uh, Sean Collin, please? Just old age him. Oh. Go, go ahead and look over there. <laughs> <laughs> Is that John Goodman? <laughs> Bullshit. Uh, he's like, <laughs> Right. I'm just, I mean, I'm lucky you didn't say Roseanne. But. Ooh. <laughs> Damn, we're not going there. I mean, you said it once, but I don't think you're racist. What? <laughs> <laughs> is, it, is it Roseanne Barr racist? Oh, he knocked the mic off. Oh, yeah, man, man down. Man, man. <laughs> now, remember, oh, remember yeah. coconut? Oh, yeah. Coconut yeah, flavored, yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we already got you once. <laughs> you, you got one. And it's February. It's you better February. not. I'm not oh, allowed. Oh, no. You better not. 25 more days. <laughs> 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 if that ain't raised, I don't know what was. March oh, is the whitest month on the calendar. Tell me I'm wrong. It's my birth month. <laughs> well. Well. Wasn't what? Scott invented well, in what? March? What? <laughs> <laughs> I guess. It was a snowy March afternoon. Oh. How do you feel about Scott? Do you have any opinions about ska music? Uh, I don't mind it. I mean, you need I, a sample like, of ska track. That would be dope. Hell nah, yeah! I definitely like the instrumentation and stuff. I mean, I'm not like crazy into it though. Bring you know in the I mean? horns. They Most play people... it a lot at work and stuff. So they they do. What do they, they play? Ska What's ska? You asking me? <laughs> well, I'm yeah, I really don't. If know, I had to guess, I'd say you're hearing some mighty mighty boss tones, maybe a sublime I, I song. I definitely, they definitely said Sweet. it was acrobats. I don't consider those to be ska technically, but one is second wave ska. Sublime. Sublime is punk, but it's aged as more I mean, they ska. Have horns, I guess that's the Long Beach gonna... City All Stars are definitely ska. And it's derived straight from Sublime. But it's just like if you've ever seen School of Rock, where music is that big old spider web. Yo, we gotta do You can go anywhere you want with any of it. We gotta do yeah. a vlog of me going to a Scott concert with Sean. I told him I'd go. Are you gonna skank? <laughs> I'll try. I'm so scared to bring him. <laughs> this is when he's gonna realize he's too old for this shit. He's, he's gonna wake up the next morning. I feel like he's just he's going just for jokes. Like he's going to bring a notepad and he's Where's just going to be writing, so writing jokes writing the whole time. Oh, he definitely is. <laughs> Yo, you see that dude over there with the three foot mohawk? <laughs> I'll be out there skanking. Whatever. <laughs> Do you know how to? I mean, I just you, watch a YouTube video of this. What is it? Like kicking a field goal constantly? <laughs> Damn. That's what, the, that's what the dance step looks like. Just kick a field goal constantly. <laughs> You're going to flail your arms. Damn. Too. Exactly. Damn, man. That's all ska dancing is. You There's can't... more to ska dancing. That's the that. only move I'm doing. But that's what's he doing? Field goal, extra You're point. You're thinking of like <laughs> ska punk. Extra point. <laughs> but but like that's... regular ska is just that two step. Like you really don't got to do much. But I'm just be out there. Boom. <laughs> see me randomly put my hands up. It's good. Just keep going. It's good. <laughs> just keep going. It's good. Like, yeah, that dude is fucking five for five from beyond twenty. If we go to a ska concert together, then you can take me to whatever concert you want. Oh, whatever. I'm taking Sean to yeah. this. I'm taking Sean to a West Side Gun concert. <laughs> He's like, yo, what is that? It's gun sounds all night, Sean. This is too loud, Duval. You just gotta, you just gotta turn your hearing aids down. You'll be all right. <laughs> <laughs> boom, 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 boom. It's like fucking Randy Marsh. Why does everything sound like shit? <laughs> Sean's like, they just kept going bah, 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 all I, night. I'm not sure this venue has been cleared with the fire marshal. Oh, like, I really, I Damn really... right, the fire marshal trying to shut us down. <laughs> shut us, ludicrous. <laughs> Sean's just outside like the black dude with the phone, the meme. It's Hello? Griselda it's, Records? Yeah, it's they're in really here. really unsafe. We gotta Some dude him. named Westside Gun. We just got to cut his hair a little different. We'll be all right. Oh. He'll fit in with the Karens. Damn. Nah, we got to give Sean like a beanie or something. <laughs> I'm done with beanies. Give him a Supreme <laughs> hoodie, a beanie. Thick Gosh, black room glasses. Yeah, we can get you in the concert, bro. No, this is my look. The dude who produced <laughs> the track probably looks like that. So you be all right. <laughs> <laughs> Just saying. I feel like it's, it's like a lot of the white dudes make the fire beats. Yeah, Alchemist is the, is the greatest beats. artist, producer. I haven't of all. heard your beats, so I can't really judge the... 
the white and you make a fire beat. Alchemist is the other. Shout outs, Alchemist. Shout outs, Uncle yeah, Al. No doubt. One of the greatest producers of all time. I definitely got I some feel fire like beats. I want to hear the beats that you'll never put out, though. I don't want to hear the fire so ones. Much. I want to hear the ones you'll never put out first and then exceed my expectations after that. Wait, wait, yeah, after I we get done, you. play some beats. You know no what I'm saying? doubt, most definitely. But what are you saying all time? I'll hit you with a hot 16. Hold on, Sean's saying that you can't say all time. No, 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 I'm not saying that you can't say all time. I'm saying that it feels like there's always the greatest producer of all time. The greatest producer of all time. Like it's it's how many great. I've been saying it since he's been out. Be. I'm just saying this dude's been out since early nineties. I'm just It just feels like it's a tossed around term a lot. That's all I'm saying. He got voted by a, a popular magazine company. What what popular magazine? Complex. How reputable is this magazine? Is. I've never read it. Oh, you're <laughs> talking about West Side, right? No, Colin's never no, read it. No, Alchemist. Either. The oh, Alchemist. Alchemist. Yeah. yeah. They, like, Alchemist is well known, like bro. What's that? Are they putting money in your pocket for advertising me? Because I don't understand why you're talking. I'm just saying, you, <laughs> you were talking about producer music. <laughs> They were just because just because you just because you went you saw Freebird live for the first time. <laughs> Who's Freebird? He saw him before the <laughs> Who's Splinter Skinner, motherfucker? <laughs> he saw They're all the, dead. He saw him before the plane. Right. Oh. Seven eighths of them died in a plane crash. You and you then one right. the plane. Right. And and propped you, the other one in a wheelchair and put him out and play the piano. And for you a was there. Years. And you was there months prior. <laughs> months prior. <laughs> you, you seen it? What no. That? <laughs> yeah. Isn't that how like one of the parts of Freebird goes? <laughs> I just remember from the Kingsman. Is that what it sounds like from the inside of a trunk? Damn. <laughs> Who kidnapped me? You kidnapped me? <coughs> Listen. <laughs> I'm on point constantly, so if you kidnap me, uh, I was tripping. I just assumed the only way you would have ever heard Leonard Skinner was from the inside of a trunk. You trying to say I got kidnapped? Perhaps the, bed of, a, <laughs> perhaps the bed of a truck. Where did Duvall go? He went to that sundown town. This is his month. Leave him right, alone. Right, damn. I'm sorry. Got me in the tr- trunk. <laughs> I'm giving you f- <laughs> it's February. <laughs> what, we five days in. I'm in the back seat. I'm in the trunk of a motherfucking Cadillac Birmingham. <laughs> damn. I got to. I'm sorry. I brought up some real fresh you, memories. You did not- <laughs> <laughs> Not, not nice. Damn. I'm not, sorry. Where was I at? Next month. Damn. <laughs> Repressed memories. You'll be out. The fuck was I doing in Noxon? Mm. I was trying to think of where it was. I swear to God, I was trying Trunk to make the Noxon. connection. Mm. Bro, this one time I was with my boys. We were on a ride out near Noxon. And, bro, straight up. We just got chased by these dudes. Like, we turned around in their driveway. They're like, yo, what are you doing in our driveway? They have like, shotguns and out. shit? Bro, I have no idea. <laughs> it turns out, bro, like, my boy, he knows uh, somebody from there. Like, it was, it's like his stepbrother. It was his stepbrother and everything or whatever. But, yeah, bro, like, it ended up being somebody we knew. But, bro, those motherfuckers was chasing us like crazy, bro. They got rattlesnake bro. fights up there. They're not right. Bro, yeah, I don't know. I don't um, give a why fuck. Why does everybody fucking just relate them to the run? They don't fight rattlesnakes. They catch I don't know them. where to come it's from. It's called the rattlesnake roundup, and not they... rattlesnake fighters. Yeah, they sure. kill them. Whatever you say. <laughs> what? I got inside sources. This is a real thing? Oh. <laughs> Again. <laughs> Whatever that magazine he was talking about before. It's not like cockfighting. You don't know that. I know for a fact it's not So you've been up there just chilling. No, I just know people. <laughs> I was rounding up some rattlesnakes, bro. <laughs> Try to go up there. No. Put on some muck boots and, oh and go to town. All night you just hear devil went down to Georgia and looking for a soul Why steel. Why is it that song? I don't know. Why are you up there chasing rattlesnakes around, motherfucker? Uh, me? That's very racist of you. That is not racist. He just. So me how you, as a white person. No, I did not say that. You said. Oh, no. Me. You said. <laughs> me. You can't it's flip not the like they're up there month. cockfighting. No. What does this got to do with my month? I ain't never seen nothing black. Month. Who started cock, cockfighting or uh, rattlesnake fighting? In a, oh, I'm not. You're being racist against white people. No, I'm not. They got heritage too. <laughs> no, I'm not. And they're just rounding up rattlesnakes. Listen, I got. Everybody else's heritage listen, is I, white people. Listen, I, I broke out of the trunk the first time. All right. I'm fucking their first cousins, you know? Ugh. I ain't say all that. That's, no, that's what they're doing, though. Uh, so they doing that, but they... <laughs> so rattlesnake fights... But they ain't fighting rattlesnakes. So rattlesnake fights is off the table, but you know for a fact... <laughs> they got standards. Oh, they're cousin fighting. Uh, see? I no. ain't say it. 
no. <laughs> I said what I said. I ain't say it. Do you know any from not anybody from Knoxville? Hell no. That's what I'm saying. I like, drove through there once on accident. <laughs> <laughs> The wrong turn. No, it's like the hills have eyes up there, bro. And, it was, and, and that shit was a short ass twenty minute flick because I was back on eighty one in no time. Oh, here over your radios. Where's goggle? Where's goggle? Nope, had my ox cord hooked up. There are too many places around here that you need to drive through a lot faster than the speed limit is. Oh, it's just yeah. unfortunate. That was one of them. I was in a work van too. I said, "Oh hell no, I got equipment in this bitch." Are you going to take your equipment? They're going to fuck me up with it. All of a sudden, it turns into Twisted Metal, and you're being ch- chased by some dude dressed as Sweet That's Tooth. what they need to remaster. Well, they are. They're, they're, they got a show coming out soon. I heard that I there was a show I don't give a fuck about movie, no goddamn show. Are you talking about the game? Yeah. Well, one goes hand in hand, usually. Yeah. Game first, show another five years later. That's true. They're probably being made at the same time, to be honest. Lies. Well, I... The Last of Us game came out, and now they got the show coming out next year. I heard that show has nothing to do with the game, pretty much. Nah. That they've changed the plot so much that it'd be unrecognizable. They actually are I don't know anything about the game or it. I'm just saying what I've heard. From what I heard, they changed shit because they want to stay true to the game. That's why they brought in, what's his name? You see the new Halo TV show coming out? I'm going to check it out. What is, is it just based on the main story of it? or it's they... just Master Chief finding the fucking okay. Halo. I mean, it works. <laughs> they've done enough, how it works. <laughs> they've done enough animated movies. Uh, now, heard, they, now they're just actually searching for a Halo. I heard they're making a uh, a Red Dead movie. I don't know how true that is, but... They thought about what it. What is that, like playing the Oregon Trail, basically? Now you have dysentery. Now he dies. I, what? <laughs> you never played Red Dead? I never even played, I don't play bro. video Red games. I never even played Oregon, Oregon, Oregon Trail. Trail. Let me tell you that much. <laughs> you getting a little personal here. This that, Hold that game near and dear. <laughs> yeah. huh? No, nah, that game's like a movie. I said what I said. Thank you. He said or- Oregon what? Yeah. I said what I said. Yo, shout out Rockstar Gunslingers. Games. Gunslingers. How do you even know that game? Gunslingers. Yeah, in high, like school, Oregon Trail. <laughs> yeah, but that was back when I... I, mean, I, I remember floppy disk games. I didn't even play that because it was too old. <laughs> so Sean, you guys playing it, you Sean must have had at, some hand-me-down shit at your school. Oh, fuck yeah. Sean was at the Electronic Boutique 1978. <laughs> boutique? Yes. That's a $20 word. Electronic... <laughs> <laughs> the way you said it, shit. Wasn't it just called EB? <laughs> I used to... Electronic boutique. Yeah, I just sound, I just said it all out. Say the whole name. <laughs> say what you just. Say it's, the like whole, a, it's like a tribe called Quest. Like a tribe called Quest. You say, you the say the thing, whole thing. Man. Right? Do they have an abbreviation? <laughs> tribe. They just call them tribe. Oh. Yeah. I thought it was gonna be like an acronym. Nope. He was hoping for something way cooler than what you just told him. Right. <laughs> just tribe. <laughs> I've well, I've heard that one. I was like, uh, well, is there something better? I was with somebody. Go put on some tribe. <laughs> <laughs> Wiggles, he's looking up like African Kenyan sounds. <laughs> Bring out the Why fe- are you Googling? <laughs> Bring out the February Google jukebox. That. We need, we oh, need a tribe called Quest. It's just the sound that you get from Crash Bandicoot when you get the mask on Luke. what do you mean? Damn, another throwback. Yeah. You got all three masks. You just run into shit. Yeah, until you fucking try and play that goddamn bridge level and you can't get past it for... 12 fucking days. I used to get stuck at the stream with the fish. Nah, dude. It's uh, it's that it's that fucking bridge where you gotta run where all the fucking slats collapse. Bro, That's the worst one. That was a long ass game, bro. Yeah. And then you gotta go back and do a time trial on each of them. Mm-hmm. Pain in the ass. Do old games. Mario were, ripped it off of old them. games were way harder than new ones. What was the favorite system you got as a kid, like for Christmas? Like, which one system all y'all like was like, yo, I really wanted that one. Uh, I don't know. I would say the PlayStation, but honestly, which I one? had a uh, I had a PlayStation Two. Where? But I was honestly hype. Uh, my dad, when I was younger, gave me a Sega Genesis, bro, yo, and that's Netflix. still, yep. bro. Sega Genesis is still one of my favorite systems. Prime. Like yeah. X Men games on the that. Sega Genesis, yep. yeah. are bro, and Sonic. Sonic the one is my shit, Nightcrawler. bro. Maximum Carnage. What's that? The one where you can play as Nightcrawler yes. and Maximum Carnage. We could turn into Venom halfway through. Yeah, not even halfway through. You could start off with them. Nah, maybe I'd unlock them. Well, not when you do multiplayer. Oh yeah, it's true. I was and he shot out that fist that like stretched out for like uh-huh. people. Hell yeah. The GameCube was dope though too. Yo, Smash Brothers Melee. I got the uh. GameCube as a gift for uh taking my PSAs in high school. Yo, you wanna hear a story about the GameCube <laughs> that was real a quick? Great ass system, man. So literally <laughs> when I used to play Mayflower, we used to have like field day at the end of the year. You know, they handed out like first, second place, third place trophies, blah blah blah. And then then they did a raffle for like 
you know, oh, here's a here's a wiffle ball and a bat, you know, blah, 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 and some bullshit. But at the end, they always had, like, a big fucking prize. And this year's was a GameCube. Yes. Right? So Standard blue, black, purple. silver. Purple, yeah, oh, yeah. Well, that, that was the regular color, right? Uh, well, yeah. I see it as blue, but different. we all see different color. I get yeah, you. Yeah, it was purple. I got you. But anyway. <laughs> so. It was the prince of gaming consoles. So, you yeah. know, everybody had, like, two tickets that got put into this bucket and like they just drew them all day and fucking read off tickets. One of my tickets got called but my other one didn't all fucking day and I knew it was coming up to the GameCube. And it was between me and one other person. No. And my name got drawn first for some dumb shit and then he got the GameCube Uh, right uh, after. So you I, had to beat him up afterwards and so take I went over, so, I, so I went over to his house after that and I played his game and then I scratched it on purpose and left. Oh, damn. damn. Fucking Long term storytelling. Damn. <laughs> Wig is a fucking origin villain. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, my God. Sometimes you, you die being the hero or you live long enough to see yourself become the villain. Somebody has a master plan with a scratched GameCube console and a plastic bubble on his desk. He just stares just, at it every day. I was just going to quote a movie, but I do not want to re-trigger any T.Y. vibes. No. no. I was going to quote The Ringer. Oh, no. Oh, no. Nope. No. Nope. Turn the page. <laughs> Turn the page. All right, Bob, tell him. Oof. <laughs> nah. I'm, I'm just fighting to move on because I really want to quote it. Page turned. <laughs> no, nah, my, my shit was the 64, of course, because I got no mercy. No, nah, mine was okay. the SNES. All great ones. I I was I was spoiled, I think, because I had every system that you could all. think I of. I did, too. I did. You had I, Gamecast? Uh, Dreamcast? He never seen my no. most wanted. <laughs> it's GameCube, and then there's Dreamcast. Man, I got Gamecast. What, did you tape them together? <laughs> you never wanted. seen Malibu's Most Wanted? Uh, I have, but not enough to quote it. Sorry. Uh, the one. I found it. I'm sorry. No, I found one of them anyway. <laughs> 64 was dope, though, because it's like... Mario 64 was untouchable. GoldenEye. GoldenEye. The original Smash. Even Perfect Dark. They ripped off a lot from GoldenEye, but great game. Conker's Bad Fur Day. Word. Explicit to the fucking max and set the page for a lot of games. After I remember that. when, like, running into the bathroom, like, pissing on the walls and stuff. <laughs> like, <laughs> I was like, I should not be knowing this as a small child. It was just such a curveball to throw at people because anybody, oh, we, I watched my kid play with this character in Diddy Kong Racing. Everything's okay. And then I'm just going to buy it. Nobody looks at the rating. Right. The rating's there, but nobody looks at it. No. <laughs> you ever it's play Twisted right Metal? Oh, of course. Yeah, that's cool. how. That's how that was. Yeah, that is how me. it sparked it. It's like <laughs> when I was younger, like that game was like, whoa, hell yeah! What the hell was the N sixty four version of that? There was a Nintendo sixty four uh, Vigilante eight. Yeah, Do the school you know? bus. Uh, you had the school bus. Do you know who See, I used they to all, fuck with? They always um, fought each other in Nintendo the, and PlayStation, uh, of course. The black dude with the two wheels. Axel. That's yeah, Axel. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I used to fuck with him. Heavy. It was such. Dude, a, I don't know yeah. why, but I did. It was such a nonconformist character to use in a game like that because he'd be dead in seconds. <laughs> his instead, his arms just <laughs> went missing. They just took jacks from Mortal Kombat and they stuck them to the wheels and they said, "Get the fuck out there!" <laughs> you got this, champ. Gave him a buzz cut. Damn. What a buzz cut. Wasn't he bald? <laughs> Jax had hair. That's all I know. Not Axel. <laughs> no, Axel. They just yeah. They just gave him the baldy. Oh my! I don't know, man. They gave him the ty. Oh. <laughs> it is not a secret. Why did you awe it? Oh. Because I can hear him now going. <laughs> <laughs> just smacking exactly. hard. It happens to all of us. Even if you just thin out a little bit, like you're not gonna have all your hair. You oh, may not mine's go bald. going. Mine's going, I'm but gonna, I'm just hanging on to it. I have the Vegeta thing going on. I got the Prince yeah. of All Saiyans Widow Peak, but the, I got the. <laughs> you got you covered gotta, up a little you bit. Cover. <laughs> there are tricks to the trade, and we all learn them. Trust, I know somebody that likes it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Couple somebody's. Oh, I thought about bringing the bowl cut back. Don't do it. Just for just bowl for a cut. couple episodes. Wig used to have this untouchable bowl cut. Yeah. Back unfortunately. In the day. Like straight Hanson. I was mm bop my mm-bop way to school like a motherfucker. <laughs> 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 bop like a motherfucker. No. Yes, he did. Yeah. No. Yeah, like a man from Milwaukee. <laughs> Another Hanson song if we didn't get the reference. <laughs> Why do you know more than one yeah. Hanson? Yeah, I used to fuck with Hanson back in the uh, day. How deep into the catalog do you go? 
three car garage. <laughs> Pretty deep, bro. Oh. Past Mbop. <laughs> <laughs> Not gonna lie. I don't know why. I just fuck with them. My White God. kid things. Well, now we know who. Well, I'm sorry. You were like 30 years old when Hansen <laughs> came out, so you really couldn't fuck with him. <laughs> so, mm, Bob, what's this shit? Yeah. Mm, Bop my way out of here. No, I ain't go front. First tape <laughs> I ever had. School. Cassette tape. First, like, bought my like the shit that I bought as a kid was Coolio. Wait, was that the first album you ever bought for yourself, or just straight tape? What does it say about me when one of the very first CDs that my parents ever bought for me was Jock Jams? <laughs> <laughs> like stadium jams I get called, dunked it called But jo- I get up again It was again. called jock jams uh, yeah. You were a big sports guy I wasn't Oh <laughs> But I don't know the I probably got that. it out The Avon catalog Oh uh, Wake up in this room Welcome to the space jam <laughs> Yeah I would have thought Duvall's first album Would have been uh WWE volume, whatever. I had one of oh, those. I, no, w- I had one I of had those. The WWF volumes like one through five. Oh, Yo, shit. true story. Yeah. True story. Yo, I remember uh, <laughs> I was at Value City with my mom. Shout out to Value City, Valley Kids, y'all remember. Okay. And, um, Wasn't that like all the way up in Hazleton? Yeah. Used to go up there get school trip. clothes and shit. Yeah. And um, I just went to Burlington. She was like, you can, get a, you can get a cassette tape if you want. You can get an album. I was like, word. So I go over and. It was motherfucking mystical. His first one, his debut. Shake it fast. Yo. She put that shit in on. She's like, you put it on in the car. I said, nah, I'm cool. <laughs> I'm going to wait till I got I, I saw I had the explicit label in the corner. I said. He, he went and got his walk. Yeah, I was, like, I was like, this ain't shake it fast. This is shake your ass. <laughs> <laughs> it's not let's get it started. Like, Did you know you plays and pimps? Yes. And uh, she was like, no, I put it on the car. I like that song. I'm like, oh, she ain't know I got the Curses version. And, like, the dude at the counter, like, let me slide. Mind you, I'm, like, nine years old. I just slipped my little $20 bill on the counter. He was like, word, mystical? All right. <laughs> let me rock. Like, I was like, word, my Anytime man. Anytime I think of that song, it just reminds me of a scary movie. <laughs> you guys fucking suck. <laughs> she starts pissing Damn. on the floor for, like, two minutes. But, uh. I remember that shit, that shit came on in the car. <laughs> I told you them first few lyrics. Everybody knows it's legendary. The man starts Come off. On, make her piss on the floor. Uh, <laughs> that's going to be wild. But uh, the first wow. lyrics of the song is I came in with my dick in my hand. That was like whistle. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about be it. Be cool. Be cool. <laughs> that was the first. Where do you go from there? Well, exactly. That's the first. All right, back, all right so Louis C.K. This, so this is exactly where we went. Back into the motherfucking store because she U turned. <laughs> that's where we went. She U turned the car. We were back in the store. I ended up getting the Romeo Must Die sound. <laughs> <laughs> Dusty Shove Pop and Try Again. Wow. All day. You got all your albums from Walmart after that. It's all day at Timberland. Picky, picky. I remember. Edited as fuck. Sam bought me a CD the one time. And uh, she was just out, so she saw it at Walmart. She picked it up. I didn't even take it out of the fucking cellophane because I was like, where'd you get this? She, oh, I got it at Walmart. I said, no, thank you. That's a lot of beats. What, what, <laughs> what, what, what artist was it? Walmart bleeps everything though, so it's <laughs> it could have just said. I feel shit. like it was Eminem. Well, that would have been destroyed. Ooh. Yeah, just instrumentals. <laughs> right? That's all it was. Yo, that would have been even even better in that case then. Uh, Eminem instrumentals. I, mean, mm, I wouldn't even want to step. If even if I had would. bars, I don't think I'd really want to step nah. to one of these instrumentals. I'm still surprised that you said one of the first things you bought was a tape. I would have thought it would have been a CD. No, nah, cassette tape. That's pretty I grew up with cassette tape. Because my, my first yeah. that I bought for myself was also a cassette tape. Oh, hell yeah. That's how I, that's how I discovered, like, all the artists I listen to now. Like, because you would see those those tapes, like, and the logos look just so cool and the little, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And, like, the Wu-Tang album was just a big-ass yellow W. So it was like, yo, you got to... It, it makes me sad that the day of albums are over. Like, no, I make... I, pl- I still have vinyl. Well, the, I, yeah. yeah, but vinyl I mean, will like, never die. You have playlists yeah. probably, and you have vinyl songs on that and everything like that. But I mean, like there no. are there are certain albums that should not be listened to broken up, and though that doesn't basement. exist anymore. Oh, oh no, I wouldn't not. say that. I mean, it just depends who you're listening to. I mean, and, I'm sure there are definitely artists that you know do something saying, where you know it's an entire. Saying, experience but I, I could agree but, with that to a point. Is that like there's a lot like music has changed to a point. There's so- like there's songs that are two and a half minutes. That's what I was just gonna say. Two and a half minutes compared to like seven. Back you know in what the I'm day. saying? And not that every song has to be that, but a lot. You know, there's right. more quality song, in, in some songs that are so you can't separate them from like 
I can't right, prime speak example. to me and breathe. Pink Floyd. There's I was literally or par, or, par, or Funkadelics. One Nation Under One Groove. The first song Back. is 13 minutes long. Led Zeppelin has two that you have to play back to back because you can't separate them, and I can't think of the names of the songs off the top of my head. Is right it now. from Godzilla? No, it's. Taking <laughs> 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 shots all day. Inside joke. <laughs> come with me, come with me, yo, Colin. Show Diddy with Godzilla. <laughs> the worst, the worst sampling Jimmy of any Page, Led Zeppelin Godzilla song and Diddy. ever. Oh, taking shots all night, John. I'm here to stay. The worst thing is that the orchestra is phenomenal. The orchestra is balls to the wall, great. Oh but God. Cashmere gets destroyed in that oh, song. Ca- no <laughs> one has much of an attention span anymore. So that is the that's biggest why... issue. People yeah. can't commit to an album. Right. They no, want two sure. and a half minute songs. They want a, a little they boot bop single, and move bro. on. They just want a single. But it's an yeah. like, experience. That's an entire album. Right. Is, like, that's what's the hardest part about music know. is like people don't want to sit down and listen I'm to it. I'm goosebumps thinking about you know the original press of Dark Side when you got to flip the vinyl to continue your experience yeah. because the songs literally just mesh together yeah dude no doubt a whole fucking song basically when you're yeah, listening to entire. songs on a random playlist and you hear a song and as soon as that song's over you're already singing the next song off the album in your head every time that's every fucking amazing time. that's stuff. classic yeah. rock and it's just honestly a, well just classic music in general anything before 2000 anything after well not 2000 maybe 2010 I mean, kendrick 2015 did it. kendrick told the whole goddamn story yeah i don't like, know if I don't know enough about it, so I have to take it. Well, I know I know a lot of rappers that are like underground or like well known, but not super mainstream. Do release vinyl um, because their albums not are even, like not that. even just like vinyl, but like bring back fucking music. Just bring back some good music. Everything's the same. Everything's recycled. Whether it be music, movies, literature, everything's the same. Nobody recycle can come up beats with and flows. Nobody can I come mean, up with a fucking original idea. I have injury music, but I will. We're definitely gonna bump it in intermission. No doubt. Uh, but uh, Sizzle's definitely got some bars. Flyboy Young's got some bars. Word. So, yo, if you definitely got some bars, we can get you into a uh, a rap competition. Whoa. If you want to be part of it, we can get you in the thirty six side. Beep, 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 beep. Shout out 36 uh, Let's go Let's go <laughs> Let's go uh, I definitely do respect you guys For what you are doing But You just gotta tone it down A little bit You know <laughs> like, just... Okay boomer <laughs> You guys gotta stop With all the drugs and... No you gotta stop With the let's go Every two seconds Oh I thought you were talking About the I thought, I, I, oh, I thought you were talking About artists No not today. the artists I'm talking, oh, about, I'm talking about Oh my man Oh man Shout out my man yo. Uh, Let's go <laughs> I was And Tissa That Jamaican air horn began worn out Patient <laughs> Oh my god dude I, I want one of them now <laughs> a sound I need a button I've been saying a button, <laughs> need a button. I've been saying a button you Right after, after the R. Up. Kelly You could definitely set that up Oh, I definitely over here. Oh, hell yeah. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> but you guys do it so well. <laughs> right? I feel like we don't need it. Honestly, we don't need it. I think the fact that we make our own sound effects. <laughs> <laughs> That's what sells it. These guys are working on a really low budget. <laughs> I mean, who needs a fucking soundboard? We We're working on a zero dollar budget currently. In. Oh, wait, Colin, what'd you donate? Six dollars. We have six dollars. We got six dollars in the bank. <laughs> we got value. Yo, play the prices right music. <laughs> How much we got in the bank, Colin? Today we have six dollars. <laughs> 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 Playing Plinko in this bitch. Sean, can we work and find you? <laughs> Me first? Playing Plinko. Well, I sorry, normally yeah. ask T.Y. <laughs> yeah, because he has a whole story to tell when you come to him. <laughs> <laughs> but I, you, you can find me on Turf and Turnbuckle on Facebook, and that's all for right now. All right, on there me. throwing shots. <laughs> I'm taking them on everybody. I'll be throwing shots on the page. Doobie. Uh, you can find me on Facebook at Doobie Branch. You can find me on Instagram at Doobie Branch Comedy. You can also find me on Turf and Turnbuckles with my man here, Mac Daddy, a.k.a. Sean Mulcahy. In time. In time, I yes. promise. Uh, you can also coming, find our page on? on Facebook, Super Smash Productions. You can find us on Instagram at Super Smash Productions, on TikTok as well. Pretty much everywhere. So tune in. And while you're watching this episode, make sure you uh, see that little thing right at the right-hand corner there, that notification, all that shit. Hit that. Subscribe. Enjoy. Austin, this is your turn. Shameless plug time. Yeah, plug on. Where can we find you? Uh, you can find me on Facebook, 
uh, uh, Austin Siegel or Illegal Siegel, uh, and Instagram at Illegal Siegel um, underscore. What about your music? My music, you can find me on Spotify, Apple Music, pretty much everywhere, uh, YouTube, wherever. I'm on most streaming platforms, so. And when can we find out for your new project, man? When's that dropping? Uh, Probably within the next month. I haven't set a date yet, but if you follow that page, it'll definitely be soon, and I'll keep updates going, so. Where's the tune in? He got some fire. Wig? As always, Crash underscore Concoctions on Instagram. This art ain't free. Um, Bipolar Project, I believe, is actually we have a date scheduled for March 29th. Uh, we're taking a different route with it right now, but it is still going to be fire. Uh, I've been sending uh, some little snippets in the group chat uh, showing some of the designs that I am working on. Uh, but it is coming soon uh, at... Why do I keep saying ah? Uh? <laughs> I feel like I said it like 10 times. But it is at the Bipolar Collection NFT on Instagram. Go like that right now. And the Bipolar Collection on OpenSea. Coming soon. Love you guys. Have a good night.